Today, we are going to talk about a fascinating topic, how machine learning can be used to help protect the environment. We'll explore how it's applied in areas like tracking wildlife, predicting natural disasters, and more. So, how do you think machine learning can help in solving environmental challenges? Today, we are going to talk about a fascinating topic, how machine learning can be used to help protect the environment. We'll explore how it's applied in areas like tracking wildlife, predicting natural disasters, and more. So, how do you think machine learning can help in solving environmental challenges? Absolutely, Ravi. Machine learning models can analyze large amounts of data from images, sounds, and sensors to monitor wildlife populations. This helps conservationists take action to protect endangered species. What other environmental problems can machine learning help solve? Machine learning can predict natural disasters like hurricanes or wildfires. If we can predict these events early, people can be warned in advance and governments can take steps to reduce damage. It's a lifesaver. That's a great point, Pooja. Predicting natural disasters using machine learning can save lives and protect property. Early warnings allow people to evacuate or take precautions. But what do you think are the challenges or limitations of using machine learning for environmental protection? One challenge is the availability of data. Machine learning needs a lot of data to work well, and in some cases, we don't have enough. For example, in remote areas, there might not be enough information about wildlife or weather patterns to make accurate predictions. You are right, Ara. Machine learning models rely heavily on data. And if we don't have enough data, the predictions might not be as accurate. How do you think we can overcome this challenge? I think we can start by collecting more data, like using sensors in forests or oceans to gather information. The more data we have, the better these models will work. Also, collaboration between countries and organizations can help gather data on a larger scale. That's a thoughtful solution, Sneha. Data collection is key, and global collaboration can really enhance the effectiveness of these models. Let's shift to effectiveness. Do you think machine learning is truly effective in addressing environmental issues? I think it's effective, but it's not a complete solution. Machine learning can help us understand the problems and predict outcomes, but we still need people to take action. Technology can guide us, but it can't fix everything by itself. Well said, Ravi. Machine learning is a powerful tool, but human intervention is always necessary to make real changes. What other thoughts do you all have on its effectiveness? I agree with Ravi. Machine learning can help us make smarter decisions, but governments and organizations have to act on that information. For example, if machine learning predicts a wildfire, it's up to firefighters and authorities to act quickly and efficiently. Yes, and it can also be expensive. Some countries or regions might not have the resources to use machine learning technology, which limits its reach. It's important to find ways to make it more accessible. That's a good point, Ara. Making these technologies accessible to everyone is important especially in regions where environmental challenges are most severe. Before we wrap up, does anyone have final thoughts on how machine learning can help protect the planet? I think machine learning is a great tool, and with more research and development, it can become even more effective. But we also need to educate people about it so they understand how it works and how it can help protect the environment. To conclude, Machine learning offers immense potential in helping address environmental challenges from monitoring wildlife to predicting natural disasters. However, as we discussed, it does have its limitations, especially in terms of data availability and accessibility. While machine learning can provide valuable insights and predictions, human action is still essential to bring about real change. Moving forward, 
collaboration, data collection, and making the technology more accessible will be key to ensuring its success in protecting the planet. Great job today, everyone! Your thoughts and ideas were insightful and well-rounded. Let's continue to think about how we can use technology to make the world a better place.